here we are. Here we are. Gym four. Max obedience of 37. We've spent so little money. Um, and it's time to do that one thing that Soap screams about and then can't spell in chat. So, um, are we ready? That's the big question. Gonna have money to buy a shiny for the eighth badge. Imagine. Right. Are we ready? I am scared. We, well, you know, we can kind of get away with a bad roll, but obviously we really don't want one. Sorry as well. I've just, I've just, I've just noticed that. <laughs> so before, before every time I do this, right? You know, I, I like, I know I could, I know I could easily look in game, but I don't. I, I, I look. I just type on the internet, just, just because it's just the habit that I've got into, right? And, um, I've just looked and seen on my homepage that out of nowhere. There's just this in the bottom corner. And I don't know why that's been recommended to me. But it just caught me off guard and just completely broke the, broke the flow of what I was saying. So, that's a thing. Um. <laughs> anyway. Alright, let's go. Yo, what's up, Wonder Wolf? 48. Oh, God. Interesting. But not... No, 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 no reroll. That's, like, I, I, can, I can work with this, probably. This is fine. I don't know why I put a hoodie on. I don't know why I was like, I'm too hot in my dressing gown, and then I put a hoodie on. Alright, Venonat, let's go. 30 defense, 26 special attack, 24 speed, plus per death, minus attack. Like, that's a that's a front runner so far. With tinted lens as well. So it powers up not very effective moves. And there's this for two grand. Spideff and speed sucks, but like what a well-rounded little mush. It's calm, so that's good. It's got tinted lens. I'm so intrigued. It really, I, I, like, I really might have to just buy 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 that bottom one. Two grand. You'd be good, but not quite what I'm after. Two grand for the bottom one is an actual steal. I know. It was this one, wasn't it? Yeah. I'm running with it. I'm not doubting it. I'm going with my gut. My cap's 37, isn't it? And that's 24. I can actually... I should possibly do actually a little bit of EV training. I can't believe it's more of a physical attacker. So we're going to lean into that, probably. And just Zen Headbutt. Everything. Because we get Zen Headbutt at 37. And Leech Life is physical as well. So yeah, we're, we're doing attack. We want them Leech Life Zen Headbutts going on. I mean, I know we've got that special attack nature. But that's because I'm going to have Signal Beam as well, I think. Just because Signal Beam has a chance of confusion. Leech Life has a chance of giving me health back. Zen Headbutt. As a chance to flinch, we're gonna we're gonna run with that. I can easily get psychic for free. I could get screech. There are many options here. Don't get bug bite though. Bug bite's tutor, which I wouldn't mind to be honest. Actually, I really wouldn't mind bug bite. I'd rather have bug bite over signal beam at that point. Leech life to get health back. Bug bite to just get rid of the berry. But leech life's gonna come in really clutch against the um, the tangler. I mean, we've got that 24 attack. Anyway, so, I mean, we lose some because of the nature, which is a pain. But we got that Spadef, which is really good. Because I want Spadef. I want to do try and make sure it doesn't die, bless it. Going into the grass gym, it's going to be all... It's going to be all well, grass stuff. I mean, in terms of resistance, like, bug poison couldn't really be better. It's just, can it hit hard enough? Okay, so I think I'm definitely going to go and attack. Part of me, part of me is thinking, what about speed? Which, you know, maybe, maybe, or I could go HP. You can only remember one time you were timed out and it was vicious. I mean, then it was deserved, right? It was. You can't change my mind. I don't remember. No. No, I don't. And I have no inclination to try. Tea consumed. We're definitely going to do attack, though. That's the main thing we know for sure we're going to do. So, with that being the case, uh, our fabled attack spot. I mean, the thing is, as well, like, I, I, you know, I didn't look up anything about this little mush. I went with my gut off the bat, and I'm okay with it. I mean, this might be the first time we end up buying a TM. I don't know. I mean, if we did go Mothra for Elite Four, we'd probably have to end up doing something about the EVs and changing them. But, I mean, for now, we're just leaning into what we need to lean into. I mean, the thing is as well, like, the Moth will be good for a few fights in the Elite Four, to be honest with you. Depending on moveset, it would be good for it'd be good for a couple of fights. It would be good for Champion. It would be good for Bruno. It would be good for Agatha. I might split defenses. I really might split defenses and just give a bit of a defense boost to make sure that that ancient power doesn't do more than it needs to. Uh, Leech life's 80 power. 
Leech Life is going to do bits in this gym, man. It did get it did get the big buff. It used to be like, what, 20 power or 15 power? And then they made it fucking ridiculous. Zubat becoming big scary. I mean, the thing is, like, Zubat doesn't even get stab on that. But the Nat. Right, what are we saying in terms of stats, the attack? 65. And that's minus 8 as well. So, I'm alright with that. Maybe it's for death of the ancient power cover. Uh, that's physical. Ancient power is physical. But that's what I'm thinking. That's that's why I'm like, do I split? And I'm not outspeeding Tangler, but am I outspeeding Vile Plume? Am I outspeeding Victory Bell? Am I am I outspeeding Blossom? Is it special? I always thought it was physical. I mean, special might be the way then. Sorry, I'm just I'm just deep in the rabbit hole here. Brain, that's good. I did not realise Blossom was this stacked. Like, holy shit. Going up against that, that is not a problem, but that is stacked. I mean, the thing is, it being pure grass is really useful for me because, purely because of the um, the leech life. I mean, we know Tangler is ridiculous. Like, Tangler's got no special defense whatsoever. We know that, but its defense is through the roof. I didn't realize Tangler's death was so low, though. So, Signal Beam might come in really useful there. I also didn't realize I had a 100 special attack base stat, which is also just nuts. Vile Plume's defense is only 85, so that's good. Yeah, and Victory Bell's kind of paper mache, which is nice. Oh, go on then. Why not? This is always fun. Just to get swept with my one, my one little chicken. Oh, we're getting absolutely swept straight away. Let's go. Cut attack. Do we outspeed it? Okay, fair enough. <laughs> okay. Oh, I love, I love Pokemon. MMO. It's so dumb. Damn it! Since I've only got a seven out of ten, I should be smart. I don't because I don't know if I can use Rock Tunnel Flash if I don't have the ten. If I don't get the HM, I'm not 100% sure. So I should do this, where I can at least get these three and get them leveled up to evolve. Do you know what? I'm so done with this. I'm so done with doing this. After this fight, I'm just gonna go and see if we can get to Rock Tunnel and if we can just use it. Even though I haven't got, like, if I've just got the badge and just see if it's pooky like that. Because what it'll be, it'll be badges that obstruct you getting to gyms or making progression will be the ones where you need the HMs. Whereas Rock Tunnel, you can, you can know your way through it and do it without needing flash. Maybe it isn't seen as imperative. I don't know. I'm just going to try this. Because this is winding me up the fever pitch. I hate doing this. Fuck the painful grind that just might not even be necessary. Do you know what I mean? Also, what am I doing? Because I've got the badge, so. And I ain't got that HM thinking about it. So I've got the badge, so yeah. This is weird. I don't understand the way this works. I don't even know what my favorite dessert is. I actually, I, I genuinely don't even know. It, I, like, I never used to like apple pie. And now, now I really do like apple pie. And I fell in love with apple pie a while back. And then like started getting McDonald's ones every now and then. Because I was like, I'll give them a try and see what the fuss is all about. And they were really good. But then when I was in Germany, after when we was on the way back from the Kadinja tour that we did. We stopped in Trier for the night. And when we stopped in Trier, uh, we went to a McDonald's there and they didn't have an apple pie, but they had a peach and apricot pie. And it was one of the best things I've ever fucking had in a McDonald's. It was unbelievable. And I just wish, wish that there would be a thing over here. Euro McDonald's are the best, dude. They are phenomenal. Good, good to see Sleep Powder doing its fucking thing. I'm not the arbiter of the Eurovision Sun Contest. I'd like to be. I'd be amazing at that. Well, this is interesting. Spider-Man moment. I would love to take over for Graham Norton for commentating the Eurovision, though. I'd do, I'd do an awful job. He's no Wogan, yeah, because he's alive. Uh, okay, we can just use it. You're going to be a little bastard, aren't you? One day, I'll learn this place. I'll learn how to get through it without using Flash, but it ain't yet. It's just such a crap part of the game. There's so many fights in here. It's so slow. The encounter rate is so high because it's a cave. I've never I've never heard anyone be like, oh my, it's Rock Tunnel. I'm so excited to go through this place. Everyone's just like, oh, let's just get through it. But at least in MMO, you can find Charmanders in here. So that's the one thing that is actually kind of redeeming about this place. I might try Rival Fight and just see how it goes. I don't think Rival's really got anything that's going to do a lot apart from his Pidgeotto. I mean, I know he's got his Gyarados as well, but I can, like I said, I can just leech life and just get health back. So I'm not really that worried. So it'd be nice to get Rival Fight kind of knocked out. Everywhere is busy. Everywhere is busy. Right, let's try this Rival Fight. Let's 
see, that's good that I'm able to counter that Kadabra. And just get a lot of health back. It's not perfect, but it's decent. Now we've got to try and... Oh, it's going to intimidate me, in it? Shit. That's fine. Don't burn. Oh my god, dude. Don't burn crits and burns, because, like, why wouldn't it, right? If you want to know what we're doing, just exclamation mark rules in chat. It'll give you all the info. If you've got any questions, please feel free to ask. I'm good, thank you. I'm very, very good. Uh, apart from just bad MMO luck. I mean, bad Pokemon luck sucks, but bad M MMO luck sucks so much worse. So much worse. How did uh, how did Overwatch go? I hope it went well. All right, that's up to 70, around about 67. Out comes the Growlithe. Down goes the attack. Out comes the Fire Fang. It's going to burn me and crit, isn't it? Fucking burn me, though. That burn is just that's so rude. I wanted health back, man. That's twice Fire Fang's hit me and burn. Yeah, I might just do Erica and take him on the next roll, but at the same time, like, there's no reason I can't win this fight. Right, so we've got the Growlithe, Kadabra, and the Ivysaur. Out comes the Ivysaur. Good. Why do you do this? I'm not, I'm not staying asleep for another three turns, like minimum. I'm not doing it. We know the leech seeds come in and the takedowns are going to start. I'm not fucking dealing with it. You've got to be fucking kidding me. And a crit. And a crit. That's just going to wind me up all night. I don't want to deal with that. Also, it's really interesting to see, like, because I picked a different starter, he has a different team, and he's got the Growlithe in there instead of the Gyarados, and I didn't realise that was going to change. Is it this one? Yeah. Lovely. Do I think they'll add Johto? Uh, yeah, but... The, the, the thing is, like, adding Johto is, it's, I feel like it's a difficult one to implement because of because of where the Elite Four is, and, and with it going back to Kanto, and the fact they've already got Fire Red in here. So I feel like if they're going to do it, it would be re it, it would be kind of hard, and I think if they were going to do it, they'd have to do the Heart Gold version, right? Like, surely they'd have to do Heart Gold, Soul, Soul Silver. We're going to do a science run with Erica and see how this goes. I'm going to spectate that battle and make sure that she has got the same team that I think she does. But I feel I feel pretty confident. Or at least I feel pretty confident that we'll be close to be able to do it off the bat. And we might need a little bit of tweaking. Alright, let's Yep. Tangler, Blossom, Victory Bell, we don't know. But that should be Vile Plume. I think that's Vile Plume. We'll see. Out comes the Venusaur. Nice. Now what's the Venusaur going to pull out against the Victory Bell? That goes away and it is the Vile Plume that comes out. Okay. I've got a feeling it's going to use... Um, is it Natural Gift? Natural Gift. And it's going to be a Fireberry. Yep. That's, that's something I've got to watch out for. Natural Gift with the Fireberry. Alright. Well, let's just see what happens. If I can avoid for now... If I can avoid for now um, having to deal with spending money on the silver powder, because that's like 20 grand, I think. Um, then I'd like to. Look at you going for the sleep powder. I'm going to get it this time, though. <gasps> oh! Okay. Natural gift. That's fine. That hurt, but that's fine. Hidden power. Oh my god, you're gonna be like hidden power flying or something as well, wouldn't you? My god. Just Google RNG Challenge Pokemon MMO. I was on the first page results on top of the video. Hey, I mean, I'd like to hope so because I'm pretty sure I'm the only person doing this. If someone else is, that'd be cool to see, but I'm pretty sure I'm the only one. I'm going to use a Super Potion because I had a feeling that was coming. 
I had a funny fucking feeling. Venom structure do nothing. Trend starter. I mean, it's not that. It's just this is me and my friend Ibufo. This is our challenge. We we sat down and come up with this and wrote the rules for ourselves. Oh my god, dude. Just need Sherry to lend you 300k and you do it. How how do you hit three times in a row on a move like that? Like how do you do it? How do you do it? This run does not deserve to die to three sleep powders. It just doesn't. I say, I say, I say this run, like this attempt, it doesn't deserve that. It might take off. I mean, people have come in and said it's cool. I don't know if anyone else would try it, but people have come in and said it's cool. And that's enough for me, to be honest. Like, I, I'm really excited about the fact that people have come in and seen this and gone, yeah, this is a cool idea and stuff. Sleep powder again. Natural gift. Alright, that berry's burned. Crit. Do you know what? I'm just burning it. I just don't fucking care. I don't care. I'm not getting MMO'd on this. I'm not having it. Absolute god nap. I know that was I know that was kind of cheap using items. Um like, you know, slightly, but as I said, um after the Tangler missed twice with the Sleep Powder, and then, you know, like, you knew it was coming with pretty much every Pokemon, I wasn't... I wasn't having that. I wasn't having that. I'm not letting a run that... I'm not letting that, that attempt die to bad luck like that when I've got items that I can use and just avoid it. I'm not doing it. Fucking God, Nat. In and out. In and out. Done. Under two hours. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Could not be happy with that really really couldn't so there here we are this is the situation four gyms done four badges done uh not even 16 grand spent we are looking mighty fine mighty fine so really really can't moan at this this has been a really decent run and uh yeah just thank you everyone for coming and hanging out um and i'll see you guys next time